So ladies and gentlemen, my name is Shania Kamita Farin. My name is Raihan Jana Prasetya. And we are from Garuda Chinakia High School. We are presenting you our research about... Our research is about waste of woolly banana skins for edible coating or longer lasting shelf life. Waste from banana skin has a very good prospect of raw material source in the making of packing using a relatively simple technology. Pectin itself is an edible stuff that has a lot of functions. For example, an edible coating for tomato. Tomato that can that use edible coating using pectin can survive for 14 days. Judging from the background itself, the problem formulation can be determined. Waste from banana skin has a very good prospect of raw material source in the making of pectin using a relatively simple technology. Pectin itself is an edible stuff that has a lot of functions. For example, an edible coating for tomato. Tomato that use edible coating using pectin can survive for 14 days. Judging from the background itself, the problem formulation can be determined in the form of 1. Can the woolly banana skin be used as raw material? 2. Pectin production by means of extraction using HCL. 3. How are the characteristics of the use of pectin products? 4. Can pectin from woolly banana peel coating? From the data, pectin from woolly banana skin is categorized in a pectin with low methoxyl. For tomato coating, the water content is 3%, ash content is 0.38%, equivalent weight is 2,500 mg, and methoxyl content is 3.20%. From the data that we got, pectin from woolly banana skin is categorized in a pectin with low methoxyl. For tomato coating, the water content is 3%, ash content is 0.38%, equivalent weight is 2,500 mg, and methoxyl content is 3.2%. Tomato that used edible coating using pectin can survive for 14 days on a room temperature, visually fresh and shrink it for 1.269% and vitamin C from the tomato is still 54.5 mg per gram. In conclusion from this study, it can be concluded that Uli banana peel can be used as raw material for making pectin by extraction using HCL. Pectin produced is included in pectin, which is standardized in food chemical codex. From the data obtained, pectin from uli banana peel is included in the low methoxyl pectin because the levels of methoxyl are obtained less than 50%. Finally, ladies and gentlemen, that is all from our presentation. I hope you all can learn some things new about it and enjoy it. Thank you very much for your attention. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.